We are moments away from tip between Ole Miss and Texas A&M in the SJB Pavilion in Oxford. And these are two teams who could use the resume boost for March. They're both top 50 teams, and a win for either would do a lot for their postseason aspirations. And for Texas A&M, the rebounding margin, too, Lindsay is off the charts, and he harped on the offensive rebounds as well. Absolutely. And those defensive rebounds is also just a big part of their defense. They get this. Rodgers triggers. And couldn't get the bounce. Rebound falls to Barker. A refresh 24 AM. Here's Barker. Swish. Three times per game in Texas AM. They had 22 turnovers that led to 23 Mississippi State points in their last contest. Warren Ware right over Rita Ibakwe. That's a tough feat to do over Ibakwe. It is. Barker fades back. Gets the bounce. What a shot. That step back. Ten left to shoot. The freshman Williams. Back to Rogers. Let's it fly. Bullseye. <laughs> India Rogers. Here's Lauren Ware. 12 first half points for the Aggies. Koulibaly off balance. Ware. Pinballed that one right back to herself. Here's a three from Roger Rogers. And another offensive board. Sahara Jones collected it. Eleven offensive rebounds for AM. Bullseye! Janiya Barker knocks it home. Riding a 7-0 run over the last three minutes. They have one SEC road win this year. It was at Missouri. Three more for Janiya Barker. 17 points. Aspirations, but she pulled her name out of the draft consideration last year. Felt like she needed to work on her communication to be a better overall player. A little heavy. And Bowles in on the steal. Off balance, got it over to Jones. And Jones off balance. The last two minutes. But is it too little too late? That's MJ Johnson. Knocks it down. KK Green pulls down the rebound, and that's it. Lopsided win tonight, Texas A&M takes down Ole Miss on the road. Their second conference win on the road of this season. And that does it for us.